what is up you guys it is Katya Volks welcome back to my channel and welcome to October meaning basic girl season of all that pumpkin spice and little fun fact I have never ordered a pumpkin spice latte in my life from Starbucks but I thought it would be fun to create one because I saw the macros on them and I was like dang that's a lot of carbs so I wanted to make a zero carb pumpkin spice latte but I'm going to be making my espresso with like one of those Italian espresso makers hold on with this little guy right here um, I don't have like an espresso or anything fancy but of course ingredient wise unless you're gonna go out and buy your espresso you can always do that I have espresso beans right here so I'll grind them up and then put them in the Italian espresso machine the key to making the zero carb the unsweetened original ripple milk because if you look at the macros 4.5 fat this is for one cup zero carbohydrates and 8 grams of protein that's why I'm saying that this has a fair amount of protein and then of course we need our pumpkin spice sweetener which this is the brand I found it's called skinny syrups zero calories zero sugar limited edition pumpkin spice hell yeah so I found this actually at like TJ Maxx but of course you can probably buy it online otherwise maybe there are other skinny syrups that you can find that are pumpkin spice but this is the one that I have because I don't know it's pumpkin spice and that's what we're making pumpkin spice lattes yes so I'm gonna quickly make the espresso and then we'll get to the rest of it and then try it out you know what I mean so let's uh, do it quickly forgot to mention but if you are gonna be making this just want to see the ratios because I'm gonna overlay music on top of the making port portion um, it's usually like a one to three to one to four ratio of the milk to espresso so just a quick tip just really quickly I did double check and it is a one to three ratio so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do like one third cup of the espresso and then a cup I guess yeah of the ripple and then I'm gonna put it in the microwave use a frother try to make it as steamy as possible for like a latte hopefully it turns out well For me. 
And there we have it, you guys. The Zero Car Pumpkin Spice Latte. Now, I did add some soy, well, I think, that darn duck, but some soy whip. Um, so obviously that has carbs on it. So, but without the added soy whip on it, um, of course it's gonna be zero carbs. And then a little pumpkin spice. Of course you can put cinnamon, whatever you like, but let's give it a taste test. Mm. That is so good. Now I don't have a way of comparing it to the Starbucks version, but definitely give this a try. So one third of espresso and a full cup of ripple milk so that it's zero carb. And then of course you can add whatever cool whip. I put 14 grams of this soy whip and it only comes out to two carbs. So technically it only has two carbs. But yes, if you enjoyed this fun recipe and wanna go try it out yourselves, do give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe because I have more pumpkin spice stuff coming your way that I'm pretty darn excited for. Otherwise, happy fall, autumn, Halloween. I love this time of year so much. And I love you guys, because you guys are awesome and your support is the greatest. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.